Irish singer Sinead O'Connor has died at the age of 56. Now this follows the death of her son Shane just last year. It's been I had grown up in a manner which I'm sure Oprah will relate to, and I'm sure a lot of women will relate to, where it was dangerous to be a female. So I always had that sense that it was quite important to protect myself, um, make myself as unattractive as I possibly could. I go through phases where I'm very nice and sweet and well behaved and affectionate and then I go through phases where I'm really cross and cranky and I want to be pampered and all that stuff, you know. You know, I'm, I'm sure I must be very difficult. It's not easy for families of mentally ill people. We, we can be difficult. but I cannot wait until the day that I naturally get to heaven so that I can see my mother again. My life has been terrible, terrible. terrible. Instead, we're dying of something emotional that somebody did to us that we don't deserve to be treated like shit for. All the flowers that you planted, Mama, in the backyard, all died in wind the sort of girl that men like to marry. I'm not, I'm not the marrying kind, really. I wouldn't, I'd be very frightened by the idea of being married. A lot of people have this impression that I'm this great sort of tough woman, you know, just because I happen to say what I think. And uh, it is a form of uh, prejudice, in my opinion, uh, for people to set me aside just because I say what I think and say that I'm a great tough woman, because, you know, I'm not. <laughs> 